Hey, I'm Albert from Muffin Group and from now on I will be making a video tutorials about the B theme and the B Builder. If you have any feedback about this video or just want me to make a tutorial about something you don't know how to use, feel free to leave me a comment and I will do my best to help you. Ok, so let's move on to the topic. Background overlay is a great feature that is available for sections only. It lets you overlay background images, videos or gradient with opacity or CSS filters like blur, brightness, contrast, saturation or hue. With such a set of options, the possibilities of working on the background are almost unlimited. In this tutorial, I would like to show you three different usage possibilities. Of course, you can combine those features yourself and create more stunning effects than ones in this tutorial. My three examples are gonna be like background image with gradient that overlay this background and image element in front. This is kind of thing where you can apply gradient that would darken your background a bit for a better display of the picture in the foreground. The second one is gonna be background video that is covered by another background which visibility can be controlled with opacity option. My screen you can see uh, the overlay background that is kinda maybe I can call it uh, dust background overlay. Okay and the third example will be background overlay that could be customized with CSS filters like blur, brightness and other. Okay, so let's move on to the B Builder and let's create the first section. Uh, so the first thing I'm gonna add is the section and inside I'm gonna put the image with that girl in front end. Okay, and the second thing I'm gonna do as an advanced tab of the section, uh, I need to put the background image. Okay, uh, I want my background image to now repeat and center it. Uh, okay, the rest is fine. And in the next step, I need to go to the background overlay tab. And here, uh, I'm gonna set the gradient. So. Uh, I'm gonna choose the first color that it's gonna be black and the second color is gonna to be white as you can see the background already covered uh, our background image it's because we didn't set the opacity yet but as soon as we start setting the opacity the background uh, image will appear okay uh, so as you can see uh, we have a nice gradient that starts uh, in the bottom of the section and goes upward. Okay, uh, maybe for the better effect I will also remove uh, the bottom margin for the girl in front. Okay, that's great. Uh, we can go back to the section uh, and background overlay tab. Uh, Alright, so I think that's it for the first section. Uh, as you can see, it was pretty easy and pretty quick. And thanks to the background overlay option, uh, we can set uh, the background image with some background overlay like uh, I did it with the gradient, but also you can set the color as well. For example, uh, okay, but we have to remove the gradient first because the gradient is more important All right so as you can see the color has been applied we can also set the opacity for this background color you can basically do whatever you want okay we can move to the second example which is gonna be the background video with background overlay image okay so let's create another section and this section is gonna be empty and Right now I need to go to the advanced tab of the section and set the background video. This is gonna be my background video. As you can see, uh, 
the background video is not big enough because there is no content inside the section so to make it bigger I'm gonna set the full screen for that section that's great looks much better now and in the next step I need to go to the background overlay tab and here I'm going to set the background image uh, which I call dust already that's great the overlay has been applied uh, on the video and now we can control its opacity to make it lighter or darker uh, and yes this uh, background overlay is semi-transparent PNG file but uh, if you for example have um, the image that is not transparent like for example this one what you can see right now there is no video in the background um, but you can control its opacity so the video which is behind the background overlay will appear let's move to the third example which is gonna be similar to the first one uh, with the difference that uh, here I'm not gonna set anything in the background tab but background overlay okay so the first thing I'm gonna add is the image with that girl in front end and now for the section and advanced background overlay tab I'm gonna set the background image that's great I don't want it to repeat and also I want to center it looks much better now and in the last step I'm going to play with CSS filters which is the option at the very bottom of the background overlay here we have some options like blur, brightness, contrast, saturation and hue uh, if you will have a look on my screen you will see how the background is blurred you can also set some brightness for that background as well uh, you can set contrast saturation and hue so as you can see uh, the possibilities of background overlay are nearly infinite um, you can create seriously advanced and modern uh, backgrounds videos whatever you want and it basically depends on your needs and on your imagination uh, so I'm just leaving it to you uh, with hope to see a great looking content that is really outstanding that is all for this video thanks for watching and remember to like subscribe and click the bell icon to get notified every time we release a new video if you have more questions please visit our support center at support.muffingroup.com Thank <laughs> you.